Hi ladies, this is Martika and I'd like to share with you um, my country, my French country mini album and recipe coupon holder. Um, this is my mini album. I'd like to go ahead and just show you briefly. Um, let me see which is the better way. I'm trying to, it's, it's the sun is hitting it so I want to make sure you get a good view of it. This is the front. I went ahead and added this image I got at Google and this is from the paper collection um, recollections I think from Michaels and uh, I added some flowers and there's a rooster and some um, feathers and buttons and all that nice stuff. Um, here's the other two pages. I went ahead and just use some burlap on this tag and just glued it on and made it into a pocket like so, so that you could pull these out like so. I used Rick Rack as you can see and I did the same here. I'm doing this real quick because I'm running out of battery. Again this one here is also well this is for journaling you could add a small picture here. I used some chicken uh, wire fence, whatever you call this, um, here as a pocket. And this is removable. And this tag I've had forever and I thought it would work really neat on in this mini. Um, again, this here, you can put a picture, some journaling, whatever. Um, I used some burlap here and this is another pocket like so that you could put a picture in. This is a, a soda cap that I bought at Michael's. Um, notice the little roosters. Okay. And um, this plaid fabric I got at Joann's. So um, here's a couple, you know, the last two pages. It is a chipboard album. So, um, it only had like five or six pages, but, so anyway, here it is. Okay, so what I basically did is all the tags I did, I went and glued them on the side and made them into pockets. Um, and then this is the matching birdhouse. It was a birdhouse, it had a little stick here for the bird to sit and it's a hole here. I went ahead and painted it and sanded, um, distressed the paint and added some moss like so and um, you know like plaid. I know that curtains don't go outside the window but I thought it was kind of cute to do it on the outside so you could see it. Um, this is a little image that I got and I embossed um, in, um, in Google. That's where I get all my images, actually. I hunt for them. So anyway, and this is a button to to cover the where the stick was, the little hole where the stick was. There's the door. But when you turn it around, as you can see, the windows. Oh, and I forgot. Um, here is the little flower, and it's on a cork. It's one of those tiny corks that you buy a pack at Michaels and so. I painted it in terracotta and made it into a vase or, or a pot, a plant pot or something. Um, there is um, the other window. But when you turn it around, my husband made a hole right here to, for, to where it opens like so. And what I did was I got an accordion, an accordion coupon holder that I had. I cut it a little bit because it was too long. So I cut it and just, you know, joined it together and made it shorter and then glued it to here. And this is where you can keep your recipes and your coupons. So that's what it looks like in the back. So that's about it, ladies. Hope you enjoyed it. And I hope I inspired you to make one of your own. Take care. Bye-bye. Mm,